Welcome back. Thanks so much for being here. On our last segment, uh, we were talking about the mass parade ball and as what happens with a lot of interviews. We forgot to cover everything. And yeah. part, of, part of that event is going to be a silent auction. And uh, some of the items that will be there that you can look at to auction or to uh, actually bid on mm -hmm. is a diamond necklace from Gregor Jewelry, also a range bag from Elka, et cetera, a Yeti cooler from Shawnee Boats, golf lessons from Big Creek, handcrafted end table from Jared Kaufman Designs, oh. and uh, what is that? What is the Abalonia? Abalonia. Ab Abalonia. It's a ring, a 14 karat gold, two Yeti tumblers with choice of engraving, jewel chest, engraving on a gun at the jewel chest. Also, a Sonic Care toothbrush from Risk Dental, and early photos taken as people arrive as soon as the photo booth uh, for fun with the friends. So they have yeah. a photo booth there. Uh, so if you want more information about that, uh, there's more information about the Mass Parade Ball at the end of the show. Give them a call and uh, find your ticket uh, at our best bank. All right. Up next, who do we have? We have Angela Broom and Terry Argyle here from Hospice of the Ozarks to talk about the <laughs> road rally. <laughs> <At> road rally. <laughs> <laughs> what are we talking about today? <laughs> So um, we're here actually to tell everyone that we are changing up our events this year. Um, in the past uh, couple years, we've, or three years, three or four, we've had Stetsons and Stilettos. Mm -hmm. And this year we're going to do something a little different. Um, we've decided to do a, fa a family fun event. And it's going to be a historic road rally and memory walk in oh, May. So okay, we're super rally. excited. Yes. Fun. And so uh, Terry will tell you all about the road rally. <laughs> She's kind of heading that up. We have collaborated with um, Vince Anderson at the library, and he's written all of our scripts. We're collaborating with the East Initiative at school. They've done all of our promo materials. Um, they're doing QR codes. I'll get into that in a minute. And they're just wonderful. As well as the Historical Society is going to open up the Casey House and the Rats Baron Houses at Cooper Park. We're starting off with the library. We're doing a route from Library to Gasville, Gasville, Bolshols, Bolshols, Flip, and Yellville, Cotter, Casey House, and then back home. So it's just a drive your own car type of thing. Drive your own car, come on your okay. bike if you want to ride your bike. Can we drive as fast as we want? <laughs> as long as you are obeying <laughs> speed <laughs> limits, we okay. do not encourage oh, okay. <laughs> breaking the I law. Everything was blocked off, and we could just, you know, but that would be no, fine. Put helmets that on would be and fine. <laughs> that would be fine. So, are there activities along the way at each of the? Well, points it's or? a history. The, the students, what they did for us, uh, it kind of started with this idea: why can't we tap into Pokemon and do something fun with oh people yeah. for mm -hmm. Pokemon? And then we talked about it with them. Nah, maybe not. The liability there, somebody walks <laughs> off a cliff, maybe a little bit too much oh for yeah. us. So, and living in overseas, I've lived in England and the Netherlands, I've been in road rallies before. And we're not going to have clues like they usually do. We're going to give them the directions from the first segment to the second. And then the students are taking a tour and they're doing, um, they're going to film it all ahead of time. They're doing voiceover okay. on the scripts. Nice. And it's going to be downloaded on a YouTube. And then they are creating the QR code. So you can tap into your phone oh, with the QR nice. code That's and then listen okay. to it. As well as we will have boards there to explain what the historical area is. So no worries. If you're not tech savvy, we will have a hard copy That's of me. everything. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Thank okay. you for doing that for me. <laughs> well, me too. Thank you very much. Yeah. And then we have um, the the fun part about it is we've got some things off to the side that you can go and check out yourself and we're going to have a little scavenger hunt. So if you complete the scavenger hunt and you turn it in, there's lots of prizes. There's an opportunity for a prize for every stop that you make. And then again, for at the end, we'll have two major drawings for if you've completed this, the entire circuit as well as the scavenger hunt. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to end up at Cooper Park for lunch, uh, music in the park, and then a wonderful memorial you can buy. It's a memorial walk, and this is Angela's side. But the nice part of the whole event is it combines the family, it combines a fundraiser, which mm -hmm. we need money because we are a 50C13. 50C13, yes. Yes, and it also touches on what hospice is about, and that's the memory walk. And that was Angela's idea, and it's a tremendous mm -hmm. aspect of it. But before we go there, the East Initiative are having a liter liter the um, literary <laughs> contest, and they're using our tagline, the journey of our past, and they're going to be writing, and then parts of what, either all of it will be on display, we haven't got there yet, or parts of it will be interspersed within the memory walk. Oh. And the memory mm -hmm. walk, I'll shut up now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you're fine, you're fine. 
So uh, the memory walk will happen at Cooper Park and it will go through Raps Barron. And along the way, um, people are going to be able to purchase, uh, preferably beforehand, so we can get them all printed up. Um, kind of what I call the political yard signs, but uh, they will be your corrugated uh, mm -hmm. signs and they will be along the path of the memory walk. And so mm -hmm. you can take these, we can have the name printed on them. If you want to take it before and decorate it up, maybe put a photo or a favorite, you know, Bible verse or quote. Memories uh, of, of people that whomever. And it doesn't yeah. have to mm -hmm. be, you know, someone on our service. This is for anyone who wants to honor a loved one. Oh, okay. wow. Okay. So we'll have that going on, and uh, like she said, we'll have some lunch and some entertainment along the way. And when, so are, when is all this yeah. happening? This oh. is happening in May, May 20th. <laughs> it's oh, on that's Saturday. A long so we way still, away. we okay. have, oh no, sure. oh, it's already February. Yeah. It'll oh be God. here we before you know it. this one in July or August. August, okay. yeah, yeah, about August that we started uh, laying the groundwork for this. So, um, yes, we, we're trying to get uh, the word out and looking for sponsorships right now to okay. help with it. Okay. And part of the reason we have to get the word out is everybody goes, well, what, what's a road rally? Never heard of that before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, you know, just trying to get exactly what it is so they understand it and then want to participate. Yeah. So that's yeah. part of the... So right now you're looking for sponsors. individual or corporate sponsors? Both. Both. Um, if someone wants to do an individual... We do, uh, we do, and, and we have sp uh, spot sponsors, stop sponsors. So if you have a business in Flippin and want to be our stop sponsor, you can, we'll, we'll make your place of business the actual stop. So people can stop at your place oh of business. Nice. Oh, okay. So we, we do, um, we are looking for stop sponsors in all of our little towns through Baxter Marion County, and uh, which is our service area, Hospice of the Ozark mm -hmm. Service, Baxter Marion County. Mm -hmm. So yeah. we're road tripping through Baxter okay. and Marion. And the stop sponsor is only $500, which is less than you pay for an advertisement in the newspaper. Well, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and, and the money is going for? It's going into just our um, general account, mm -hmm. which helps pay for um, hospice care, end of life care. Um, because we are the only nonprofit in Baxter and Mar Marion County, we are um, always in need of funds because no one is ever denied care regardless of their ability to pay right. mm -hmm. so and okay. whenever you come on hospice um, everything is covered your medications any kind of medical equipment um, you know you you have access to a doctor nurse aide social worker spiritual care person um, volunteers so uh, we have a big pretty big team then um, so, and then we also have our bereavement services, and those are free of charge, regardless if you've had the hospice experience or not. Um, and we follow our families also for 13 months. So, if you know of someone that may need a um, join our, our bereavement mm -hmm. class, mm -hmm. um, they can contact us, and uh, we have meetings every week. Mm -hmm. okay. So, so the service doesn't stop. Conti it continues oh, after you, yeah. uh, yes, okay. after um, a loved one dies, we do. We follow the families for 13 months. Hospice care isn't just about the patient, but it's yeah. about the, the whole family. Mm -hmm. So so the event, the event is the road rally, and it's coming up May 20th. Is that May on the 20th? Saturday? It it's is a Saturday. On a Saturday. Starts what time? We're going to meet at the library around 8 o'clock, and people okay. will start taking off from the library between 8 and 9. Yeah, and they take that off on their own, and, and there's, there's uh, QR codes that you can... You can follow with all the information, or you can just each get a hard copy right there. Well, each stop, you're going to get the information for the next stop. Okay. So it, at the Mountain Home, you'll get one. You're going to follow out 201, and there's a little script written about um, the old military road and a couple things that happened there. And then you go to Gasville, and you'll learn how Gasville got its name. And if you want, you can go through the, uh, through the cemetery, which we had fun doing. And then after that, you'll go into Midway, and Gasville, you'll get the next card, and then you'll go to Midway, Midway, you'll get the next card, et cetera, et cetera. So it's kind of a mystery scavenger hunt it type is. of thing, yeah. Yeah. geocaching, whatever, all just a, just a fun uh, afternoon, day trip. Absolutely. So it's going to be wonderful. And it's okay. the weather's going to be beautiful. You can have your top down, you know, <laughs> you can open up your sunroof. Yeah. <laughs> Now, where uh, can people find more information about it? Um, we do have a Facebook page. You can actually go to uh, Like Us on Hospice of the Ozarks. And then uh, we do have an event page for the, for, uh, the okay. journey of our past, uh, Historic Road Rally and Memory Walk. Uh, it is also on our website, which is uh, www.hospiceoftheozarks.org. Okay.
Okay. We'll come back. That's fine. Yes, oh, please closer come back. to the yeah. event. Oh, yeah. Oh. We want you to come back. Yeah. We'll come back. R remind yeah. us. We'll have more questions, too. More in-depth in -depth questions. Yeah. yeah. By that time, yeah. you'll have all the information. We'll have it all. <laughs> we <laughs> might have it all sorted out. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Appreciate Welcome. it. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for Up having next, me. Chris Kern's here, and she's on her phone. Get her camera. Get the camera over there while she's doing her typing <laughs> on her phone, <laughs> which is nothing new because we all do that, right? We're going to be talking about the truck party. We'll be finding out all about that. In just a few minutes, stay with us. You're watching 726. <laughs>